This Coast Guard cutter is in harbour right now, but she spends much of her time out at sea on the hunt for those boats loaded with migrants that come up from the Libyan or Tunisian coast. Boats that are unseaworthy and overcrowded, exactly the kind of vessels that were involved in those catastrophic sinkings in recent weeks off this island. Sinkings that cost hundreds of lives. Here on the bridge, on the chart desk, you get a good sense of the sort of sea area that we're talking about. There you've got Sicily, here the coast of Tunisia, and there Libya. And that is tiny Lampedusa Island. And this Coast Guard cutter is looking to intercept in this area boats loaded with migrants coming up these days mostly from Libya. In general, when uh, we intercept this, uh, uh, this ship that uh, in general are uh, little uh, fishing vessel of wood or uh, little rubber boats, if the situation is uh, dangerous, we take immediate action in order to uh, keep this uh, boat near to our ship and uh, we keep all migrants and we take them on board of our ship. When this Coast Guard vessel does find a boat packed with migrants in need of rescue, it would normally launch one of its rubber dinghies here and just Imagine the sea, it might be at night, the sea might be rough, there might be hundreds of migrants desperate to be picked up, moving around in a chaotic way on an already sinking boat. The moment of rescue is sometimes the most dangerous. Sometimes there can be the risk of a capsize, the risk of migrants spilling into the sea around the dinghy.